Apurva Gupta, Assistant Professor in Biani International Institute of Engineering and Technology, welcomes you all on behalf of Guru KPU for a video lecture on Combined Gas and Steam Power Plant. Friends, as we all know that the energy demands in India are increasing on a very steep note. And to meet those energy demands, we are having a different, a lot of different power plants like steam power plants, thermal power plants, hydro power, pl uh, uh, power plants, nuclear power plants, solar power plants and all those. In those power plants, one of those power plants is a combined gas and steam power plant. In this type of power plant, we are using basically the exhaust or the hot gases of the gas power plant in the boilers or the heat exchangers of a steam power plant so that the overall efficiency of the power plant is increased. Uh, I'll give an example. In a basically in a gas power plant, what we do, we use the compressor to first compress the intake air. Compressed air is provided in the combustion chambers to raise its temperature. Now the hot and high pressure gas is expanded on the gas turbine and that gas turbine is coupled with a generator where electricity energy is produced. Now that hot and uh, hot and high pressure exhaust gas is also useful in our heat exchanger of a steam power plant. In the heat exchanger of a steam power plant, feed water from an uh, from an cooling tower or the condenser is feed to the heat exchanger. Now here, the heat of the gas turbine power plant exhaust gases is utilized to heat the feed water, and the heated feed water is now provided to the steam boiler where the where it is boiled and converted into steam and this steam is then expanded on the steam turbine and where it can produce electricity. The other way in which we can use the exhaust gases is combustion air. In this method, what we do, we provide the exhaust of the gas turbine to the steam boiler. In the steam boiler, to burn the fuel water, it, uh, uh, to burn the fuel water, we require lot of heat energy. And that heat energy requires air also. The exhaust gases from this gas turbine are high components of oxygen, like 16% of oxygen they are having. And these are sufficient to produce to provide the combustion air for the steam boiler. Now, this steam boiler is utilized to heat the water from the feed water. This, then the boiled water is converted into steam which is then expanded on the steam turbine where it is coupled with the generator and electricity energy is produced. Then both of these manuals we are using the gas turbine power plant with a steam power plant where this gas turbine power plant is utilized to produce the peak loads of the hours um, for especially in the industrials. Industries where the peak loads are generally from 8 to 12 after that they are having a lunch a lunch breaks and from 1 to 5 they are also having the peak loads. Now during these peak loads are these combined gas power plants can be utilized. For more video lectures please log on to www.brookapio.com. Thank you. Thank you.